Hey everybody, Scorpion here. So this video is going to be on your CD-ROM boards, or, I'm sorry, hard drive boards. Hard drive, yeah. Um, so when you get a hard drive, this is pretty much what it looks like. So I'm going to walk you through it and uh, give you some information on what type of board goes into which category and what they're paying as of today. Y'all stick around. Rock, 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 on the track, boy. All right, so this is a CD hard drive. I don't know why I want to keep calling it a CD-ROM. Anyway, hard drive, okay? So you can get your hard drive most of the time you can have a couple of screws in it to take out of the back. Um, this Torx bit sell, set helps a whole lot or if you don't want to do it with a drill and want to do it by hand, one of these sets helps. But it takes those special like eight star screws. So these will come off and the shape, size, and color of the board makes no difference. Um, as you can see, we have blue and green here, okay? The only thing you have to worry about is the big plug-in port on the back. That's what tells you whether it's SATA or non-SATA. That's your two different categories. So all of these here are SATA, and all of these here are non-SATA. And again, shape, color, size does not matter. The only thing that matters is that big port on the back. So, with that said, here's two of them and I'm gonna put them together so you can see the difference. So this big port, that's all you gotta worry about. This is SATA, this is non-SATA. Non-SATA is the higher paying grade. I'm thinking it's like $16 a pound, something like that. They've got the big pins in there. You can see them. Tilt it back. Look at that gold. Woo! And then the SATA, which is the new style, have the pins that look like this. And they're just on one side. They're not on both. If you look this way, you can't see them on the other side. They're just on one side. So SATA, non-SATA. Very important, the big plug, that's all you need to know. That's all it's about, it doesn't matter what's on the board, the shape of the board, the color of the board, the size of the board, none of that matters. It's all about the plug-in. Non-SATA has the big pins, pays more, SATA has the smaller, and pays less. So I hope this helps y'all. Um, I've got all mine sorted out over here, split up into the two groups, so all I have to do is weigh them, pack them and mail them to board sort and uh, board sort will give me money this is also non-sata this is a dv uh there we go again this is a hard drive from a laptop okay so if you've worn across one that looks kind of like this it's also non-sata doesn't hardly weigh anything but there it is so a lot of people take the boards and put them in one stack, take the hard drives, toss them over in something else, whether it's aluminum breakage or whatever. Some yards will buy them as they are like this. So again, check with your yards, check with your local places if you want to mail a board sort. It's a good source of uh, income here if you can get enough. 